Do not do that. All right, not too much on my head because I'm not bald, so don't even. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. What y'all doing? Sorry, this is not no vlog. This is a video. I need to stop fucking ratchet. Okay, so that's out of video. I'm showing sure y'all how I install my wigs. Y'all, I talk really bad. I'm not even going front to y'all. I talk real bad and I don't know how to explain anything. So this will be a voiceover because when I'm in the zone, I'm going to show you the products I use, how I do it. But this will be a voiceover because I can't talk and do this wig. Not this one because I'm very scared about this wig because this is a new... I'm pro If y'all haven't seen the video before this, y'all know what wig I'm talking about. That blonde, that blonde wig. That blonde highlight wig. The brown. I'm scared because I don't know how this will look on me. Um, Y'all know how I feel about color the ginger. Mm, it was cute it was cute on me yeah it was cute the red yeah that was cute on me that's it <laughs> i am so terrified of colors like other women can do it i'm not one of them yet so this will be yeah and i, I know y'all know this my acne gone because i told y'all it was my cycle my cycle coming off and the stress the y'all can see i'm not stressed i'm not yeah, the acne is gone. I don't really get acne. Like, just to get it, I usually get it when my cycle coming on and my cycle going off, so it's gone. So, like I said, y'all, I can't talk because it's just hard for me. And, yeah, I already oiled my scalp with Erica J, y'all. Y'all already know. Y'all already know. And I'm, I need to get the bigger bottle because, yeah. And I just bought and I just got some new glue in the mail. But, yeah, so... This will be very in depth by me explaining. This will be voiceover, though. Most definitely voiceover. So, if you guys would like to continue watching, stay. Okay. Hey, y'all. So, I'm going to re oil my scalp with this anti itch oil just because I don't want my um scalp to be irritated so i'm just going over it and i don't know if y'all can see i try to avoid the front of my hair with the oil like the edges part just so my edges don't be oily like when i apply my glue it doesn't interfere with it I am the topic of conversation, it's a celebration Let's toast to the fact that I moved out my mama basement To a condo downtown, cause it's all about location I sit and drink wine and watch Californication of life You should have been here to kick it with me We could have split this whole thing up 50-50 But now I'm at the 4040 getting bitches tipsy Killing shit, they're ever so talented, Mr. Ripley How I go from being the man that you argue with Make sure after slicking your edges back, you blow dry your edges dry because you don't want your gel and your lace glue to interfere with the install. You could tell me that you never heard none of my songs. Long as you end up saying one day you plan to listen. Because what's a star when it's most this important fan is missing? Next, there are different options to clean your forehead. You have alcohol, witch hazel, and micellar water. Uh, either one of those three will help clean your forehead just from any oils or any dirt you may have to not interfere with the glue. Else's success brings pain when you're no longer involved. That person has it all. Now, this is the way I do my ball cap method. Everybody else is different. I start out by cutting holes uh, for my ears.
I am the topic of conversation. It's a celebration. Let's toast to the fact that I moved out my mama basement to a condo downtown. Cause it's all about location. I sit and drink wine and watch California Cation of life. You should have been here to kick it with me. We could have split this whole thing up 50 50. But now I'm at the 40 40 getting bitches tipsy. Killing shit that ever so talented, Mr. Ripley. How I go from being a man that you argue with to me and Dwayne Carter putting out the hardest shit. I should want to go back to the one I started with. But I'm addicted to this life, it's gonna be hard to quit. Yeah, just ask me how things are coming along. You could tell me that you never heard. After the glue is dry, I use two different kinds of makeup to tint my legs. I use the LA Girl Pro Concealer or the Ruby Kisses Foundation. I decided to use my LA Girl Pro Concealer just because it doesn't really matter which one as long as you get a concealer or a foundation as close to your skin color. Change. It's funny how someone else's success brings pain When you're no longer involved, that person has it all And you just stuck standing there, but I'm gonna need you to My reason behind pulling that part of the wig cap in the middle of my head Just because you guys know when sometimes you're cap pulls back after you like try to take your wig off i just put it there just so it has extra hold on my head i personally use for my own use actual lace tints for lace but i'm really used to it but for beginners you can really just use foundation or your concealer. I am the topic of conversation. It's a celebration. Let's toast to the fact that I moved out my mama basement to a condo downtown. Cause it's all about location. I sit and drink wine and watch California Cation of life. You should have been here to kick it with me. We could have split this whole thing up 50-50. But now I'm at the 4040 getting bitches tipsy. This is a really important step because I know a lot of people, like a lot of people mess this parts up. I cut my ear tops off before laying down my lace because it's just so much easier. And it's like common sense to me. So I, I just feel as if for beginners, you should cut your ear tops off just so you don't have to deal with all the hair in the way when you're laying down your lace or if you cut it wrong. Now I'm just going back and making sure my lace is tinted as possible. I'm just using anything left over on my foundation brush. The only I did it all for you. This part really isn't beginner friendly. I cut the lace completely off as close to the wig's hairline. It's just my method and my way of doing it. I just find it so much easier for myself. But as a beginner, you shouldn't cut your lace off before gluing it. That's an easier way. That's the way I learn. But this is how I do it. And right here, I'm just going back to customizing the hairline to mine the way it fits me the best. So I'm just parting out hair that I know I'm not going to be needing and extra lace. <laughs> This is the glue I use, the Erica J Hold Me Down. And so for the sake of this video, I just use two layers of glue just because I'm not having this wig 
on for a long time. And maturity is realizing you really only need one layer of glue if you're using Erica J because this glue holds it down. Like I have no problems with this glue. Of course it'll lift like when you sweat and stuff, but other than that, this glue is gonna hold your wig down like forever. I use a popsicle stick for my glue because it just gets it nice and even. with cutting the lace before applying your wig you should try it if you can I just feel, feel like it's much easier and as you guys can see I just lined it up perfectly like where I put my glue it just makes sure it's pressed into the lace I take my rat tail comb and I comb it into the glue just to make sure it's securely on <laughs> just to customize it a little bit more cutting off extra lace that I know I don't need and that I know that I'm not gonna glue back down and for the lace and the hair that I am keeping I go back and I just re-glue the little parts that I did in this they won't be expecting shit when Capo go to slide cause I told them that we put that shit by okay I'm cutting in the top but y'all I'm I'm not mad at it, but I'm still scared. Like, mm, it's cute, whatever, but honestly, I'm still scared. Like, look at this in the middle part. Oh, I'm so scared, and then the side part. Oh my gosh, I'm scared. But I also wanted to kind of let y'all know, so since, okay, I applied the wig. The wig is on, it's glued, it's secured. Not all the way, because I still have to melt it and all. But the main, like one of the, your foundation, your foundation of your wig install needs to be like s perfect. Like when I mean foundation, I mean like if you're wearing a middle part, you need, don't even worry about the edges. Don't even worry about the hair. Don't even try to strain. Do not even try to style your wig unless your foundation is on point. And I'll get into that once y'all see me. But right now, I'm about to get into my foundation. So, yeah. Your hot comb is very important. I like to hot comb um, my hair before melting my lace because I just feel like the heat of the hot comb really melts your lace into the glue just for a seamless look. And before I apply my melting spray in my band, I just go back over my lace just with a little bit of foundation just to make sure it's seamless man push me to the air so it really ain't my motherfucking fault man i'm not to blame man the fucking industry is cut though i'm not the same man and i can let you check the tag you know? <laughs> do not spray this right on top of your lace if you do that out do not do that don't spray that on top of your lace get your finger you tap it. And that's an important part too because if you just spray it on top of your lace, it's just gonna look real nasty. Where you take your band off and it's not gonna look cute. Like, do not do that. That that, that makes me so mad. You can tell when you look at people's installs and they just spray that stuff right on top. You can just tell and it just looks so bad. Yep, on the other side, niggas acting like we tied. I've been gone since like July, niggas acting like I died. Won't be expecting shit when Capo go to slide. Cause I. 
And right here, y'all see, I'm just trying to figure out where I want my part at. And y'all see, I chose the side part because it was really giving. I heard that Beamer was an honor. My old man, honor. Don't even drink Coronas. What type of drink? And for this part on the video, this is just me styling the wig, y'all. So from this point on, it's just me deciding on how I want my hair to lay. So just enjoy the rest of the video. Get some tips on how I style my hair and enjoy. I've been moving calm, don't start no trouble with me Trying to keep it peaceful is a struggle for me Don't pull up at 6 a.m. to cuddle with me You know how I like it when you love it on me I don't wanna die for them to miss me Yes, I see the things that they wishing on me Hope I got some brothers that outlive me They gon' tell the story, shit was different with me God's plan God's plan I hope back sometime Hey y'all, so I just finished curling my hair And let me tell you, it took like so long It actually took like 30 minutes, like exactly Not like, almost exactly, but like damn near 30 minutes and this hair is so thick, like Jesus. And let me tell you, I'm nowhere near done. Like seriously, I am nowhere near done because I don't, I, I showed y'all that I started to layer it, but I didn't because it was just so long and thick. I was like, no, I still have to layer it. And I know that I'm a, bro, don't piss me off. Don't, don't piss me off. I still have to cut it and then like, recurl it the way i want to and so basically i want to get the full effect like the makeup the hair so right now i'm gonna give it a good spray of spritz because y'all know spritz hold every uh it cut off but um right now i'm gonna get the full effect i'm gonna do my makeup and i'm gonna come back and then that's when i'm gonna take the pins out so i can like so it can set a little bit because i want the curls to pop and I still have to layer it and like recurl some pieces. I just know I have to recurl it because that's what it is. But like, y'all, isn't this so cute? Like the pins, like I look too cute. Like I've been having my um, I look like a house slave. I would have been in the house just to let you know. And 
That's not funny. That's not funny. I'm gonna make a um, boomerang. Hold on. I don't know how to... Y'all, stop looking at me. Stop looking at, looking at me. Ooh, it is too hot. It's because of this nail all this heat. It is like so hot in here. But I'm gonna get the full effect. Like, I'm gonna do my makeup. Oh my gosh, y'all look at my boyfriend. He is so cute. Like he is so fine. I don't want to show y'all my boyfriend. Like, why would I show y'all my boyfriend? I'm gonna show y'all. Look at him. Oh, he just he just do it for me every time. Every time. Now I'm gonna stock his page. Cause he's just so fun. But I'm finna do my makeup. I mean, I I look so cute right now. Like I look so cute even without the makeup. Should I do my makeup, y'all? I yes, I'm gonna do my makeup because I do have to take pictures for my thumbnail. Yeah, I'm gonna definitely do my makeup. It won't be too much, but I'll be back. So stay right there. I'll be eyes be right back. Stay right there. Quick little makeup look. It looks cute. I didn't put any gloss on though. Which is fine. I think I'll put some on after. But my makeup came out like really good. I didn't even put that much on. I literally put makeup right here. But now is the moment of truth. Let me fix this lighting. Yeah, now's the moment of truth with the hair. So I'm gonna give it one more good spray spritz. Cause we still have a lot to do so i started on this side so we're gonna start taking it down on this side oh i'm so excited hopefully are y'all too close no y'all not too close This hair is so thick and it, it's it's only 180 percent density i don't know why like it feels so thick because this took me so long to curl like so long okay and no i'm not putting edges on because y'all know i haven't y'all know i haven't really been doing the um edges look i really like how i need some room it's a room okay i'm liking it i'm liking it okay now i need to shape it y'all spritz is gonna be your best friend because spritz holds it in place like if i want it to go freaking if i want my hair to go that way it's gonna go that way if i want to go this way it's gonna go this way okay now i'm gonna take I'm so I'm gonna start on this side. It just come out. Okay, okay. I'm gonna do my fingers on this side. Oh <laughs> please. <laughs> I know I did that. I know I did that. <laughs> I ain't gotta say too much, you know. This is what I'm talking about. This one cutting. Yo, I just always surprise myself every single time. I was real nervous about this color. <laughs> I'm not even gonna say it. Um, ooh, ooh. I 
Y'all, look at my hair. <laughs> Let me check the weather for tomorrow because if it's sunny tomorrow, I need to go take pictures. If y'all can just see the mess, like, under me right now. <laughs> but that's normal. We doing hair from, like, start to finish from, like, bleach and plug here. Like, come on now. Make this cool real quick. Chill, just vibe, just vibe, just vibe. Just vibe. Tuh. Look at all that highlight. Look at all that. Look at that color. Spritz gonna do it every time. Spritz gonna do it every time. I'm telling y'all, y'all better get y'all. This spritz, the blue one. It's the only one I get. I need to get some more. Okay, y'all. This is the end of this video. If y'all had like it, please give it a like. Get, please give it a like and leave me a comment. And if you are new, welcome. Please subscribe if you haven't already. If you're from TikTok, hey y'all, I really do appreciate that y'all showing me some love on TikTok as well. And thank y'all for coming to my YouTube channel to support me. Also, if y'all don't follow my TikTok, y'all need to go follow that. And if you don't follow my Instagram, y'all need to go follow that. So, hmm, it'll be in the link. It'll be in the description. It'll be everywhere. Y'all know my name. It's Curia Renee everywhere now. I rebranded. It's Curia Renee everywhere. I love y'all and I'll see y'all in the next one. Deuces. Bumpin' B, hit the side